there is no place in our country for anti-Semitism. And for $25,000 to be transferred from the government of Canada to a group that is known for furthering anti-Semitism is, is absolutely alarming. It's appalling. It's disgusting. And so there, there needs to be an investigation. There needs to be an understanding of what took place here. And, and it should be noted that this is not the first time that this has happened. We've, we've been here before, haven't we? Laith Maroof, a raging anti-Semite who is incredibly vile in the comments that he made online, was granted $133,000 through the Heritage Department. Of all things, he was granted that money to run anti-racism training. I, I mean, the hypocrisy could not be more rich. And to this day, the government has not recouped those dollars, even though they claim they've tried. And so you have this individual who is out there, who continues to be a raging anti-Semite, and has $133,000 from the Canadian public to help further his cause. And then now, to make matters worse, there's this organization or this group of anti-Semites who are now conducting, they did conduct, a three-day conference at the University of Alberta. And their speakers have anti-Semitic co content all over their social media pages. I, I have it right here. Like, it's, like, these are just a few that I printed out. One page, two pages, three pages, four pages, five pages, six pages, seven pages. And there's multiple posts on every single page. And these folks got $25,000 to host a conference at the University of Alberta. I, I don't understand how any member around this table could be okay knowing that government money went to support something like this. <laughs>